happening now. State crews are once again working with Honolulu police to clean up Diamond Head and enforce no camping rules. More than 30 camps on both sides of Diamond Head are being cleaned up this week. Dallas Hontiveros joins us live with more details. Morning, Dallas. Good morning, Christine Ross. Yeah, this is going to be taking place all this week, and the Honolulu Police Department is definitely going to be helping the Department of Latin and Natural Resources when it comes to this mass effort. But unfortunately, this isn't a new challenge or a new problem. This is something that is very common in this area, and a lot of residents and people who come out here for their exercise do get frustrated with this issue. But this is going to be taking place all this week. Like you mentioned, Ross, over 30 camps on both, side, both sides of Diamond Head. And we also know that this is more than just a plan to move these camps out of here, but to really outreach to anyone that they come across to get them the help they need while still enforcing the rules. So we're not going to see probably much activity right now during this hour, but we hope to speak with residents as they wake up for their morning jog to hear what they have to say about this. But if you want more details and also the coverage that we've been following with this issue, you can head over to our website at khon2.com. And of course, if there are any updates, we'll keep you Posted in our future newscast. Reporting from the Diamond Head area, Dallas Navarro's KH2 News, working for Hawaii.